We are gathered here today to celebrate one of life's greatest moments, to give recognition to the worth and beauty of love, and to add the best wishes to the words which shall unite Andrew and Amber in marriage. Dear Andrew, the day is finally here. The last three years has been an incredible journey, and I'm so honored to become your wife. You taught me more about life and love than most will ever learn in a lifetime. While most parents meet their children on the day they are born, I met mine on August 18, 2011, over Dairy Queen Burgers. You have been so patient as I have found my bearings and have tread water beside me as I figured things out. You are an incredible man and father, and I cannot wait to join you, Caleb, and Drew at the end of the aisle and start the next wonderful chapter in our life. All my love, Amber. I, Andrew, choose you, Amber, to be my wife. I, Amber, choose you, Andrew, to be my husband. To have and hold from this day forward. For better, for worse, for richer, for poor. To be faithful to you alone. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Now this is my desire. Consume me like a fire. Cause I just want something beautiful to touch me. In the honesty and sincerity of what you have said and done, it is my honor and delight to now pronounce you husband and wife, Andrew Eugenio. I love you. And finally, to my bride, we took two uniquely different paths in life. Our paths sometimes, ironically, have come close, but they never met until I think the moment it was supposed to happen. And today, the past officially joined. And we always talk about living for today, living for the moment. And I know for myself personally, it'll be a lot easier to live in the moment, to live in the now, because I don't ever have to worry about tomorrow, because I'll always know you'll be there. I love you with all my heart, and today I'm so happy to tell you I do. I will love you more and more as each day passes. Love, Andrew. Oh, there, I did it. <laughs>